what's up and welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm just going to be redoing um, my steps to moving to Philadelphia. Stay tuned. Okay. So if you watched my video, I had six steps to moving to Philly. So now I'm going to redo those steps. Uh, I am in my new office before it had showed my old office with my old information on there. I'm no longer with that brokerage. I'm actually with Compass right now. So um, here's the six steps that you can move to Philadelphia using a Compass agent like me. Like me. <laughs> All right. So step number one is watch some of my videos on living in Philadelphia. On this channel, over the last six months, six plus months or eight months, I don't know, time is different with COVID. I have done several videos all th over, over, um, over a couple, over the past few months and where I go over the best neighborhoods, the worst neighborhoods, different areas, as well as some hidden gems if you're thinking about moving to Philly or you just, you're just looking to tour Philly. Um, whatever, just watch some of my videos. And you know, I provide a lot of information as to what it's like to live in Philly. Step number two is contact me and we will have a conversation. Contacting me is really easy. I'm available by phone, text, or email. You can feel free to leave a comment below. I have my information down below in the description. Contact me below and, um, and we'll have a conversation. Um, in that conversation, we will discuss what you're looking for in a home. Have you talked to a, a lender? Uh, what is it about Philly that you're interested in? What areas do you are thinking about moving to? What areas you don't want to move into? And you know, what's your time frame? And um, that leads me into step number three, which is that I will send you out a buyer questionnaire. Now, as a buyer, if you're thinking about buying in Philly, uh, Philadelphia, um, the buyer questionnaire is just a series of questions where I ask you what your name is, what's the best contact info, what's the best time to, to contact you, what do you prefer, um, what are you looking for in a home, what's your ideal budget, um, what are you looking for in a home. That way, it helps me save, uh, it helps me be able to figure out what home you're looking for. Save time on finding a home. Now, we all heard that time is money. Time is also a luxury. So for my clients, I just wanna make sure that we're not wasting any time and losing too much time because you're not gonna get that time back. This is just an, a short and efficient and easy way so that we all know and we can all be on the same page as to what you're looking for. And yes, just because you put it on the, on the questionnaire, Things change, you know, and that's fine. But my goal is to make things as easy as possible and to provide the most value to you. Step number four, <laughs> step number four is that from that questionnaire, I will set up a collection, which includes coming soon, private exclusive, as well as what is on the market. Now here at Compass, we use collections. Collections is just, is basically our search and it's your private search to based on the criteria that you have set out that you're looking for in these areas or in homes and within a certain price range and throughout the collection what's really cool about the collection is is that we can interact based on these on the collection so if you see a house that you're interested in you can either favor it you can trash it you're like you can say you're not interested in it you can comment on like hey i like the backyard in this or hey i really like that kitchen what have you we can communicate back and forth through that so and you can even set up a tour request and just to talk about more about private exclusives and coming soon, um, private exclusive is a Compass product that only Compass agents have. If you're working with a, with an agent that is Compass, we do have access to what our listings are so that are private that are not necessarily um, blasted out to the market, but it's private exclusive. Eventually they will be a coming soon, which everybody gets a gets the chance to look at it, but it's not open to the market yet. 
and ultimately what's for sale is where it's open to everybody and all brokerages all buyers everybody so but if you want to know what exclusive listings we do have you may want to have a conversation with me step number five is to set up dates for the tours so I may have been sending you several collections uploaded um, throughout some period of time. You're interested in seeing homes in these areas. You're, you're looking at these particular homes. You want to go see them. For one thing, you can even contact me to let me know what homes you were interested in and then I can set up the tour for you. Or you can let me know through that collection <laughs> tool where I can be where you let me know what you're interested in and I will set up the tour for you. So the tours, I just request that we have 24 to 48 hours, preferably 48 hours ahead of time, because some homes, they are still occupied by the seller. It's COVID. Um, we want to make sure that, you know, we have to make sure that we're masked up and that the seller knows to make their home available. So we just want to be able to do everything safely. And as well, and not only for the tours, if you don't want to go see the the, tour, the homes in person, which we can still do um, for as of right now, um, we can also do virtual tours. Many homes nowadays have switched to providing a, um, a virtual tour uh, for their to, for um, buyers and their agents, so that you know to help market the home, and in that way you can be able to see whether or not you like the house or not and you're interested in seeing the home in person. But regardless, I will set up those dates for the tours that you're interested in. Okay, so step number six, we are at setting up your lending. Okay, so we have to talk about lending because as a buyer, you have to know whether or not you're able to afford the home that you're interested in or you're able to afford the homes that you're thinking about purchasing. So we don't wanna waste anybody's time. With setting up your lender, I will partner you up or I will recommend to you some lenders that you may be interested in and that may be able to help you purchase a home. So that's just the, that's the point of the questionnaire. So based on the questionnaire and from our conversations, I will recommend you um, to the lenders that may be able to help you. And don't, and just because I recommend them, you can feel free to look and use whoever you feel for. My recommended list of lenders is people that I have personally known and worked with and had success with in the past. For lenders, uh, lenders can vary depending, like their procedures can be different. And you don't have to tell me, I don't need to know your financial situation, but your lender does so that they can be able to determine what, how much you can be able to afford in home. So with that being said, we just ask that you please set up with your lender prior to going out for the tours because when you set up your lending, we need to have a pre-approval so that if you do see that perfect home, we are ready to strike and put an offer in. These homes do not last long, so as we can see in 2020, but we don't wanna miss out an opportunity. Step number seven is to place an offer and I will guide you through the, the buying process. So this is just an extra step um, is you will play, if you find a house that you're interested in, I will place that off for you. And you know, based on the outlines that you have set for me, like we will go over how much you're looking to purchase for your home. You, when do you want to settle when you're able to settle? because not only do you have to work, we have to work with your schedule, we have to also work with the lender schedule. So just knowing that when is the lender being able to settle and when you're able to settle and close on the home, and as well as how much are you looking to put down for your paint for your earnest money deposit? That's a little bit, and what inspections as well. Um, inspections is a very important thing. You want to make sure that you're getting a good product. With that, I will guide you through the buying process. With placing an offer, an offer is as like I would advise you as to where we should come at, at come in at for your home and we will work out the detail, we will negotiate throughout the, and if your offer gets accepted, then we start the buying process, 
where um, we would set up, deal with the lender, get your get all your documents into the lender so that it can go to underwriting, and we will set up your inspections so that you can be so that you know what's going on with the house, and as well as um, setting up title and getting the title and all those documents together and certs so that to prepare you and your home for settlement. You know, there's a lot of people that work simultaneously throughout the process. Me as your realtor, I am basically helping you through the process and just kind of um, negotiating all throughout the way. We will negotiate inspections. We will negotiate any, any additional terms that needs to go on to the contract. But other than that, I'm just here as support and to coordinate to get you ready for settlement. So that is it. I ended up at seven. I feel like there should be another step. And now that I think about it, there is another step, which is step number eight. Moving to Philly, you will, when everything is done, we will settle and you will be moving into your new home. And step number eight is that I hope that you can refer me to other people that are able, that I'm able to help you with your process. So if there's anybody that you know that <laughs> that could benefit from me, from me working as a realtor, please share this video with them so that they can know what the steps it is to move to Philly. And even if you live in the area, you just need an agent. I'm here and I look forward to working with you regardless for, and I look forward to helping you find your new home. Thanks and have a great day.